them for penalties at scrum time because that's creaking and that's about to break. <laughs> we know when Colton gets the ball, he's the runner. The rest of them are one-off runners. So let's just recognize personnel. You look up, you see Foy yeah. get him out of the corner, line them up, square him up, and big hit back. Oh, yeah. Boys, you know what's coming. Boys, like what Marty said to me, we can break them, we're playing territory. We can around at the back anymore. I'll make sure I take ownership of us at the back. Yeah. Play territory. Yeah. If we do that, that's where we them. So we got to stick to that, eh? Yeah. Yeah. Zero, zero, boys, zero, zero. Let's go, right? boys. Hey, that's right. it. It's so cool. fucking all started. Oh, no, oh, one, one. Two, three. Oh, blue. Ready? Ready? Oh, 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 That's the detail that we need, right? Fucking great effort tonight, boys. So today, right? I'm so proud of you, man. Awesome. Let's go, Schwartz. Hey. Let's go, boys. Couldn't be more proud of you, boys. Right? Oh, four, three. three, one, two, three. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, Ryan Trolls here with Next Level Rugby. We have an on-field interview with the captain, Next Level Rugby's man of the match, Alex Schwartz. Big day for Old Blue, big day for you. This was the target, right? Yeah, yeah this is what we've been aiming for all season. Uh, finish on top of the ARP ladder, which I think we did, tied with life at the top of the ladder. They haven't lost in about three years. You know, this is our Hall of Fame weekend, so we want to do it for all the old boys out here this weekend. Absolutely. A long time coming. You guys have been working hard for this. Tell me about that, 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 that journey, right? Because it was yeah. all about it. Yeah, well, uh, end of uh, October last year, we went down to life and uh, we got a wake-up call. We lost to them by about 40 points and the next week we had a meeting, we had a players meeting up there in the, in the sheds and we talked about what we wanted to achieve over the season and, and how we were going to turn our attitude around and we haven't lost an ARP game since then and, and today was the, was the icing on the cake. I tell you what, it's fantastic to watch this game. The way you guys play had a little bit of everything. Yeah. Chip and chase, big hits, yeah. you know, forward ball, backs wide ball. Yeah. Great stuff, just all around good rugby yeah, today. Yeah, one to twenty-two. Everyone put in. You know, we talked about uh, all week and in the sheds before the game about how everyone's going to contribute and to pull out this win because life's class team and we have to do it for eighty minutes. And I think we did just that. Absolutely, it was great to see somebody finally putting the, this the test to them. Right, this yeah. is the first time they played down for quite a yeah. while. So, outstanding yeah. work today. Anybody else you uh, want to pick out is like really uh, putting their hand up for you Yeah, today? I think Luke Hume's come back from injury this season. He's had an absolute cracker. Uh, yes. Last couple of games, he's stepped up, scored a few tries, and he's been handing out Easter eggs, as he likes to say. Yeah. Um, but yeah, once again, 1-22, to 22, I think everyone chipped in. All the coaching staff, the hard work that Marty puts on, in off the field, as well as Ash Moeki, our, our assistant coach, and Levon and Gary, our second second team coach. It's been it's really been a whole club achievement. Absolutely. Well, congratulations. I Thanks, know you Ryan. guys were working hard. Good yeah, stuff today, Appreciate Alex. it. Thanks, Cheers. Man. Ryan Trost with Next Level Rugby after the Old Blue victory over life. We have USA Eagle, Nate Augsburger, Northeast Academy stud as well, back in town for the big game, eh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Flew in this morning. Couldn't nice. miss it. Yeah, absolutely. How did it feel watching the game in the stands? You like to be on the field, I know. Yeah, I usually like to be on, but uh, I couldn't be more proud of how these guys played today. Obviously, uh, we were able to come out with a win, and uh, the refreshing thing to see was that the blood was in the water and the boys went and finished the job so uh, I think they represented for Old Blue as a club well and we have an anniversary dinner tonight which um, we're all very proud to be a part of and 
will be uh, will be there in memory of Bill Campbell, and we get to put on for the club. So it's a it's a really great day, especially getting a win over a quality team like Life. Truly quality team, like. It's the first time we were starting with Alex that uh, they've lost in, what, two years, something like that? Yeah. So beautiful stuff. What's been going on with you guys over at the OTC? Uh, the OTC, we've just been working hard. We're, uh, we're grinding right now to get through the end of this season. Uh, we're fifth in the world. Um, we got to do whatever we can to try and close that gap between fifth and fourth. So that's all we've been focused on is breaking through. And uh, the team's still coming together. We're still working hard we got to close this season off. So that's all we've been focused on. Paris is next, and uh, we're going to have our go at that and try and bring home another cup for this for this country. I'm hoping so. You guys are so fun to watch. You're really good to watch. I get to teach my kids the Rentham Youth Rugby. This is how we play the game. Look at the channel, discipline. Look at the everybody's doing everything. You guys are It's so good to watch you guys. I appreciate everything you guys are doing over there, and good luck in Paris. Hey, thanks, Great Ryan. to see you, Nate. Really appreciate it, Ryan. Cheers. Thanks, Ryan. Hashitashi, having Kirky out there, man, it's great to have him. He's a good friend of mine, but uh, he's also a great guy to go out there and represent and fight for a spot. So, you know, love having guys like him at camp, for sure. Long time coming, right? He's yeah, yeah, hard. long time coming. He works his butt off. So a little a little progress is uh, very good for a guy like that. He's going to take it. Right. I'm here with Luke Hume. Absolutely. Luke, i uh, got to say, great match, great match. But uh, one, th one bit of controversy up in the booth. Yours truly selected you as man of the match. Thank uh, you, Mike. Appreciate it. Yeah, and Alex Schwartz, deserving, took it from you. But <laughs> you were all over the pitch again. This time you're wearing number nine on your jersey, and it was appropriate. <laughs> now, I, I normally wear number 20 because the, uh, the number 15 is an XL, so I don't know but, what they'll think of that. So I just uh, I normally ditch it, put on the number 20, but uh, this time around... Uh, the nine was left sit there, so I thought, why not? Luke, you all world, all world, all fucking world. We're gonna have to bleep that out. That was the mayor of, of the Bronx. We have Greg McAllister off camera making signs at us. But Luke, uh, a big day for Old Blue. Yep. Anniversary, 53rd anniversary, I believe. Uh, Bill Campbell's passing, but you guys have him smiling because you put on a show. Yeah, you know, it's obviously tragic what, ha what happened to Bill. He's a foundation club member. You know, he founded the club with about six of the other lads a uh, long long time ago uh, it's just it's a privilege just to be a part of something special you know it's uh by far in my eyes the best club you know in america um obviously two clubs that come close is life that we played today and, and nike in their right mind uh, although we don't like them too much feelings mutual uh but yeah you know it's just it's obviously a privilege to be a part of uh, this great club get a win and uh you know team effort once again well he'd certainly get a kick out of the fact that you guys were all over the pitch in all phases of the game there was some you know, some exchanges of unpleasantries with some 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 haymakers thrown here and there, and then you're in the Standard. middle of you're you're in the middle of the, the the rucks and the malls and everything else. Why why is it that you're up all the time in there? Is it is it? Do you feel that you got to get the boys going a little bit? Uh, I've got. I think I've just got little man syndrome, <laughs> so uh, you know, I just want to get aggressive and get in there. I like that part of the game, obviously, with my rugby league background. I used to play hooker, so you're always in the middle of the tackling. I don't really get much of that on the winger at fullback, so I, I like that side of things. Um, so, you know, I get in there well, when I can. Toward the end of the game, yeah. you took on, is it Kakao? Is that how you say the, the big Fijian? I have absolutely no idea. The, seven fl the number player. seven flanker, the guy that was Does rambled well. down, and you, you tackled him, held him up in the try zone to save the try. Yeah, it was just lucky that... Uh, that he ran up upright because then I could sort of get him. If he went low, I was no chance. Yeah, but you, uh, were, you, you did it. And, I, and I, <laughs> I've said in the booth, that's the kind of thing that sends, sends a signal to the rest of the guys on the squad. Yeah. You're in there late, late in the match. you got a 37-19 lead, and you're taking on a freight train. The guys are rolling piano. Yeah, hey, you know, like I've got my job for the team. Everyone's got their job for the team. Hookers have got to make their throws. You know, got to do their scrums, same as the props. You know, the backs, Birdie's got a 10, got to kick off the park like he did today, he done well. But not so much off the tee again, but we'll get what we can get. And then my job, obviously, is to defend if we get in one-on-one -on -one situations or to, you know, add a bit of spark and attack. So we've all got our own jobs. Once again, team effort. It's always great to get a win when it, when it is a team effort. So there's no controversy, there's no story that it was an Aussie Fijian thing. Nah, I just, I, I, I'll, I'll say I got lucky on that one. I think nine times out of ten he runs over me there, so I, I'll take uh, I'll take the one I got. Fair enough, fair enough. I, <laughs> all right, brother. Thanks, Great mate. match. Uh, man of the match B, Luke Hume here. 53rd anniversary for Old Blue. Thank you, sir. At Rocco Bicamiso Stadium. Cheers.